but, but dearie, you're just a kid. If it wasn't We're for you and you meddling kids. We're 30. <laughs>Hi everyone, welcome back to Player Guides. I'm Hannah. I'm Cameron. And I'm Osprey. And Osprey is on the sticks going through a Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. Yes, we, we just beat uh, Gardenia. We've oh, got John. the Eterna City Gym Badge. Um, and I guess we're figuring out where we're going next. So <laughs> in Eterna City, there is Team Galactic has a building here. Mm -hmm. um, first, we're going to the bike shop. What? Oh. The uh, owner is not here. Yep. So Team Galactic, I guess this is a thing in... I guess, is it because, like, the bad guy teams are kind of modeled off, like, the Yakuza, where there's, like, a legitimate business front and then the criminal business side of things or something? The fact um, that they, like, have a public building here? Uh, they leave it kind of vague. They just... They have the resources. Thanks, Bidoof. Team Galactic is an interest in the world. Our gaze is beyond the stars. Okay. Welcome to Team Galactic. Are you here to blah, blah, blah? Get off the property. All right. <laughs> Are you here to donate your Pokemon? Is what uh, said. No, fuck you. <laughs> Would you have to bring the pain like we did with the cycle shop manager? All right. Fight him. Yeah. I can't. Here? Are we gonna get stuck? There that we guy. go. Double battle. All right, astonishing undertaking. We are a meddling kid. <laughs> Sorry, dearie. Team Galactic doesn't accept children as members. Time to accept some fists in your face. Wormpole and Zubat. Yeah. Zubat. Oh, this works out perfectly. Yeah. Yep. This worked out real nice. <laughs> Psychic for a poison, flying for a bug. Ooh, and psycho cut. Nice. I don't remember. But it's cool. Yeah. So I'm just going to stick with confusion for now. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. I think confusion is the right move. Absolutely. I just love the name psycho cut. Yeah. Eat it, Wormpole. We got two more to chew through. Glammeow. Cascoon. It's interesting that they use Cascoon. Um, you think if they're like in the teens in terms of level, they'd start using uh, the final evolution. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Kadabra is fierce. <laughs> mm -hmm. That was all he burping just then if that got caught on microphone. <laughs> I heard him. I didn't, so I think you're good. <laughs> okay, we kicked ass again. Yo. I feel like I got meddled with. But, but dearie, you're just a kid. If it wasn't for you and you meddling kids. We're 30! <laughs> we old! Not really, but... Shh, no, we're not. <laughs> Is that not really? <laughs> Ow. <laughs> what are they doing? Okay, I don't new think energy sources? Finding new energy, yeah. yeah. There's very much, the more we interact with Team Galactic, the more it just feels like a cult. Yeah. We should, they should have hopefully one of those conversations with the grunts down there. Someone's just like looking at cat videos on YouTube or something. <laughs> I would be, I, I would be more surprised if somebody wasn't looking at, uh, cat Pokemon videos. Yeah. Or, or even just browsing their equivalent of, uh, the illegally small subreddit or whatever. Oh, yeah, yeah, like R, R, or whatever it is. Mm -hmm. You'll never yeah. believe that this Meowth can talk. Well, like, there's one where it's all about, like, I think it's called Illegally Small Cats, and it's spelled, like, S-M-O-L. Oh, gotcha. And it is really a 
they have some really adorable kittens on there. It's just like, oh. I like really cute animals. That's Nothing fair. That's what I was saying. That's part of why I'm a Pokemon fan. Some yeah. of them capture kind of that cuteness. Oh, 100%. I feel like Pikachu and all its different, like, generation clones um, are, like, trying to capture that cuteness. Mm -hmm. I, so... This might be, a, I guess, a rough opinion, but I've never found Pikachu a cute. Do, have you? You've seen Chubby Pikachu, like the original Pikachu, right? No. So I mean, yes, I guess, but I've never. I don't know Pikachu in general. I've never found cute. I like Pichu. I like Raichu. I like Mimikyu. I think those are all both very cute or cuter than Pikachu. I've never found Pikachu itself. So you know cute. how Raichu's kind of more round? Yeah. The original Pikachu design was more like that. Okay. And then, for some reason, they, like, slimmed it down, I guess? Same way about Pikachu, and then I played Let's Go Pikachu, and then I was like, oh my gosh, this Pikachu is adorable! <laughs> yeah, I guess adding, like, because they added a bunch of, like, animations and personality, and that definitely helps a lot. Um, um, I'd be curious about Let's Go Eevee, because I always really liked Eevee. Okay, so what we'll do is when I do the live stream, like, for like two hours of uh, Let's Go, um, I'll do Eevee for that one. But after we get done recording today, I'll just show you a quick intro to Let's Go Pikachu. Oh, yes. That, that sounds would be, good. Yeah. Now, this scientist I dig, like, I wish he had more than one Pokemon to make it a little more challenging, but I like that they gave him a Kadabra. Like, that's a real yeah. threat. In certain cases. He looks like how I feel in the mornings, usually. <laughs> Just, like, undead. <laughs> yeah. Quick, use a radiant damage. Oh, wait. All right, Hannah. Yes, sir. Uh, which planet do you think uh, this one Ooh. is named after? I'm going to say Jupiter for this one since the other one was Mars. Okay. Watch it be Saturn. Eh, did you want... There you got her. How silly of me to even ask. You want to free the Pokemon? Yeah, that's going to happen. Oh, she's got that cool like outfit thing where like one side is pants and one side is shorts. Hey, I was right! You got it! Again with the Zubat. <laughs> Ollie is uh, being a stinky little boy over here. That's why we've got a little quiet. <laughs> yeah, I think, his, uh, I think his anal glands are <clears throat> bothering him. Oh. Well, the good news is, even though she's a commander, she's still using Zubat, so we can take care of that pretty easily. Yeah. And done. Next! <laughs> Next! <laughs> Gun Tank. Tank. I don't know if I've seen Skun Tank. Keep? I don't remember if it's Dark Poison or Crap. Uh, no, I it's think Dark it is, Poison. Yeah, I think it's Dark Poison. So, I'm gonna use... Alright, Shelly, it's your time to shine. Shelly! Let's do it. So, Skuntank, I think it looks really awesome. It's funny, we haven't seen its Aww. base form. But yeah, it's, it's, it's pretty a... cute. How insolent. Take a bite of this child. Oh yeah? We'll take a slap of this. Uh-oh. Shelly's gonna be okay. Shelly's a champion. Who was the um the bug the bug type Pokemon that we had in Ultra Moon that always came in clutch? We named it Heimlich, but what was its actual Volt? Volt uh Vika Volt? Vika Volt, yeah, Vika Volt. Mm. That was a good one. That is not doing nearly enough damage. 
I feel like stat-wise, oh. Bastet or Hitchcock or well, Yertle. What is poison super effective against grass? Yeah, if I recall correct. You know what? I'm just gonna switch to Bastet. Use charge and then. Um, oh yeah, I like it. Plus, we get drop an intimidate on. I gotta get me a fighting type. Yeah. Uh, Absol knows a fighting type move. I think. I don't attack. think it did. Uh, attack gotcha. uh, doesn't really. It's not an attack. Yeah, yeah. Hey, nice. that, that did helps. Some damage. Oh, Orenberry. Okay. We'll see if I last. Bastet may go down, but I Flame can't. Burn. Oh yeah, you avoided it. Nice. Nah, we can do this. We can do this. Uh, I'm not gonna risk the next one to swap. Yeah. Makes sense. I think that makes sense. Eh, that didn't do a ton of damage. I'm more worried about the poison. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we probably won't survive the next move. Unless we avoid it. Come on. Oh, or we're faster in this case. Oh, Ace! nice. Oh. oh. your math. Yeah. I, I figured it was a launch, but considering hey. I didn't have a Pokemon ready that was well built for dealing with that. That and isn't yeah. this like the first faint we've had? I think in so. In a long time. Yeah. So like, you know what? Good on you, Pokemon Diamond, for providing a bit of a challenge. Mm hmm Ooh, ancient power. What does that do? Ooh, rock move. And it may also raise all your stats at once. That seems good. Yeah. Awesome. Um. But yeah. I also wasn't paying attention to what the levels were. Being careless cost me too much. Yeah, it did. <laughs> Well, aren't you tough? It's okay, though. Our official Pokemon statue investigation is finished. And Mars has collected energy from the Valley Windworks. No, she didn't. Yeah, we defeated them. We're pretty much finished here. I'll let you in on one little thing. Our boss is researching the myths of ancient Pokemon. With the power of mythical Pokemon, he will become the ruler of Sinnoh. I suggest you keep out of Team Galactic's affairs from now on. This is your last warning. So the whole thing at Valley Windworks, they had been collecting energy for a little bit. Oh, gotcha. So they got just wanting to get more. Well, good. We saved this dude's Clefairy because Clefairy is adorable. Um, Clefairy, uh, I think we said this trivia every time we played Pokemon, but Clefairy was the original Pokemon <laughs> mascot before Pikachu kind of took its spot. Gotcha. I don't know that I knew that, actually. Thank you very much. I, I don't know that it ever was officially. I know that I think that was originally part of the idea. I don't think it ever actually got implemented at all. In the Pokemon manga, Ooh, cruise by my cycle shop. Reds, okay. Reds' first starter Pokemon was Clefairy before he got Pikachu. But that was after the games. Um, yes. Yeah, that, that came game. out of like nineteen ninety. Oh, they left seven or whatever. Yep, they cleared out. Well, I think we're going to have to, unfortunately, call this episode a little short because we got a puppy we got to take outside. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but uh, we still beat Team Galactic. Yeah. We beat Team Galactic. We booted them out of town. Like, we seem to have literally run them out of town. Yeah. And All we've of got... the runs that were here are gone. Yep. And we've got the cut ability, which means we'll be able to get some secret items on the next episode. Uh, so I know this was a short one, but thanks for playing with us, everyone. Thanks, everyone. Yeah, see you next time.